Okay, so the first step that you're gonna wanna do is take your main line, which in many cases will be your braided line. So right here, I don't have an actual fishing rod with me, so I will use this braid right here as an example. So right here we have our main line, this is our braid. You wanna hold this off to the side for a moment while you get your leader line or your tag end. This is oftentimes going to be your clear monofilament or fluorocarbon line, but also this knot will work for just about connecting any two lines. I've connected braid to braid, a monofilament to monofilament, fluorocarbon to monofilament. Once you have your two lines, once again, this is going to be your leader line in this case, and then this is going to be your main line in this case. You want to take your leader line, which here is this clear fluorocarbon, and you're gonna make a little loop. Once you have your loop, you're going to take your main line, which in this case is this green braided fishing line. You're gonna go through the loop, as seen right here. Then you're gonna take the braid, and while you hold the loop of the fluorocarbon or the monofilament closed, You're going to take the braid and wrap it around your leader about four or five times. It should look like this. Then you're going to take this tag end, this free end of your main line, your braid, and put it back through the loop that you made. with your fluorocarbon or monofilament. Pull that shut. You're going to lick your fingers, kind of rub it on it, that way it lubricates the knot a little bit. And then you get to pull that tight. And as you see right here, the knot clinches down on itself. It's barely even visible, it's extremely small, and then you just take your scissors or your braid cutters or your pliers that have scissors on them and you simply cut off the extra tag ends and there you go now i have fishing line connected to fishing line you could pull this just as hard as you could pull just about any other fishing line and this will hold all right thank you for watching